Good morning, my beautiful internet friends, and happy Sunday to you. Today is gonna be a little bit of a different video where it's more of a question to you guys. I'm gonna give my thoughts here, but I would really love to hear what you have to say because I know you guys come from very diverse backgrounds, and this is a question that I think most people have some kind of answer for, no matter where you come from. Does everything happen for a reason? I, I know so many people who have strong opinions on this issue, and the reason I ask this question is because last week I reacted to a video where someone was talking about why God doesn't heal amputees. In the comment section, of that video so many of you guys were, were pointing out to me everything happens for a reason that you know the reason that I've gone through what I've gone through is to help other people that God is using me and things like that and so I've really been thinking about those comments a lot I am not someone who believes that everything happens for a reason personally I know I'm in the minority of the population when I say that and here's why and I'm open to having my mind changed which is why I would love to hear what you have to say but I don't see any evidence for that idea. I don't see any evidence for the idea that everything we go through happens because of some cosmic purpose or some cosmic reason. Even when we talk about that in a religious sense, like God causes everything to happen for a reason, I don't think that's true. I don't think God is orchestrating every aspect of our lives because we have free will, right? If, if you believe that sort of a thing. I firmly believe that we have the power and the capacity to bring reason out of any crazy circumstance. But personally, sometimes I wonder if we try to over explain things. It is so natural to need to know answers, especially when something harmful has happened, when something traumatic has happened, when something we do not understand has occurred. Like, I want to find a reason why. Like, I want to know why that has happened, right? I just don't think that there's always a response to that. I don't think there has to be to be at peace. And that's taken me years to come to. There are many years I spent agonizing over why everything happened to me, that, that happened to me when it came to the trauma I experienced in the evangelical Christian church and from Christian people. I went through tremendously difficult and traumatic things and I was trying to figure out the reason for it, like why I went through that. And I came to the conclusion that there there wasn't a reason why. I could choose my reason why. And I've done that. I've tried to use that pain to help other people as I've continued to deal with it and heal from it myself. And I feel like the same thing applies when we're talking about physical things like losing a limb. A lot of people said that the reason that I lost my leg was so that I could do this, so that I could you know, help people share my journey and share my experience, but I feel like that's almost like if we're talking about some cosmic force or God orchestrating that, that sounds borderline abusive to me. Please tell me that I'm wrong. But like, I would never walk up to you, like pull a machete out, like just like chop off your arm and be like, look, look at all the good you can do now. You can help people with this pain. That would make me a psychopath. And if a person did that, we would think that they were mentally unstable, insane, and a criminal, rightly so. So I think I'm missing a part of the argument when it comes to God or the universe causing things, causing bad things to happen so that we can help other people. I fully believe in helping other people. Like that's what I, that's what I try to do with a lot of my life. That's what I try to do with a lot of my platform. But personally, I don't think that's the reason why anything has happened. I think it's simply what I'm choosing to do as someone who has free will and choice, which I'm very grateful for. But I know that a lot of people think very differently. I know that a lot of people strongly believe in purpose and in reason, that every single thing we experience happens for a reason. I would really love to know why you think that, if you're someone who thinks that. I totally respect that, if that's the case. And like I said, I'm happy to have my mind changed and my mind is open to be, you know, expanded and to, to learn new things and different points of view and different ways of thinking. But so far in my life, I've come to the conclusion that everything does not happen for a reason, that we get to choose what kind of reason we want to bring out of the trauma, the pain, the difficulty, and the good things that we've experienced. But to me, I don't see a force making it occur. I don't see God making that happen. I don't see the universe causing that. I think sometimes crap happens and we get to choose to respond as unfair as that is sometimes. So I'm really looking forward to reading your comments and to, to hearing your thoughts on this because I've just never been able to really make peace with that idea. When I lost my house in the Black Forest Fire, and I did a video about that a while ago, I'll put a link up here or up there, up here, yes. A lot of people told me that it was God's will for my life, that my house burned down, that I lost everything that I owned, that my entire life was blown apart at a time where I was really mentally unstable. And I, that's when I really started to question things because people had told me that my entire life, right? Like no matter what I'd gone through, you know, it always happened for a reason or God was orchestrating it or something like that. But I was thinking about, and I was like, why, why would God cause a, a forest fire, a natural disaster, 
uh, take two people's lives because two people died in that fire, cause over 500 people to lose their homes, throw so many lives into uproar, because yes, absolutely good things can come from that, and for me, they did. I, many of them were because our family made choices to bring good things out of a crappy situation. But something weird happened in the forest that day and a fire started. I don't think that there was a cosmic or universal or spiritual force, you know, like lighting that match. And I don't think that there needs to be. Like I said, we get lost trying to worry a little bit too much about over explaining things because we need, like we need a reason that something happened because sometimes when bad things happen, they're so overwhelming and they're so horrible that it seems unspeakable, it seems unthinkable, and so we wanna be able to explain it somehow. And so I think, I, I wonder if sometimes humans, like as a, as a human species, that we don't reach to the idea that there must be a reason for this even if we don't know what it is, instead of accepting the idea that crap happens, that sucks, and we get to decide what we're gonna do in the aftermath. But like I said, I would really love to know your thoughts on this because I am still forming my opinion on this, and I look forward to hearing what you have to say. So let me know, and while you're heading down to the comment section to let me know your thoughts on why everything happens for a reason or why it doesn't happen for a reason, make sure you hit subscribe on my channel and like on this video. I would love to see you back here. I'd love to keep hearing your voice on this channel. And know that whatever you think, I respect it. As long as it's expressed respectfully, I would love to hear whatever you have to say. Thank you so much for listening, guys. I hope you have a lovely rest of your Sunday. I love you guys, I'm thinking of you, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Have heard from the sky.